guys, are you guys ready for the best WWE prediction video on YouTube? Well, you've come to the right place. You're at the Cali and Dread Squad, and I am David. I, I should have actually got some WWE cards and did the prediction, but I did not do that. So we'll have we'll just go to predict it, and then maybe this is WrestleMania season, baby. So maybe um, the next one in February. I'll grab some uh, wrestling cards and we'll crack open some wrestling cards and we'll do the predictions at the same time. Okay, so something about the uh, Royal Rumble. The Royal Rumble is this Sunday, January 31st, and it's been produced every January for the last 32 years. Um, it started in 1988. 32? Yeah, 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 I'm right. <laughs> Um, so it's named after, of course, the Royal Rumble event. And what's the Royal Rumble, you'd say? Well, it's where participants um, enter the ring at timed intervals. So I think it's every five minutes. Um, so last year, Brock Lesnar came in first, and he took out the first 14 wrestlers. I think broke the record. Um, he was the champion at the time. And he ended up losing to who is the champion now, and that is... Um, Oh, I can't think of his name. Why can't I think of his name? Uh, my, my, my mom, Drew McIntyre. Okay, so he got knocked out by Drew McIntyre in the Royal Rumble, and then he lost to WrestleMania to Drew McIntyre. And I think Drew McIntyre's had the belt pretty much ever since. Um, so it should be interesting um, what's going to end up happening. Of course, take a look at the shirt. Adulting with children. You can get one of these made as well. It's super easy. Go to, go to adultingwithchildren.com. Um, you can actually make your whole family. So instead of putting it in the back of your car, you could be wearing it instead of putting it on your car, which is perfect. All right, guys. So you can stream this live event live on the WWE Network at 7 o'clock. Uh, the pre-show starts at 6. So 6 o'clock to like almost like, it should, it should be over around 10, 10.30, 11 o'clock. Um, now, I only have six matches, which I'm like, there's 30 participants in each Royal Rumble. Uh, there's two of them. There's one for the men's. There's one for, one for the women's. Um, so I know I'm missing a match or two probably. Um, I just can't find it or the WWE is making it super secret. So um, let's start off with the Universal Championship. And it's going to be the champion, Roman Reigns, with Paul Heyman in his corner versus Kevin Owens in a last man standing match. Uh, my pick for this one is for Roman Reigns to retain the championship. Um, he will retain the Universal Championship. He'll go back to SmackDown, and he'll hold up that title up high. Um, yeah, because I think they're going to be doing uh, Roman Reigns versus, I don't know, hopefully The Rock at WrestleMania. That would be super awesome. Uh, I thought they were going to do Roman Reigns versus Goldberg. But when I go to the next match, you will understand why it's not Roman Reigns versus Goldberg. But, yeah, I'm like, it, it could be Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns versus Goldberg um, for WrestleMania if someone wins the championship next match. And that next match is the WWE Championship. We've got the champion, Drew McIntyre, versus Goldberg. Goldberg. Man, Goldberg was awesome. I'm like, he was awesome in the mid-90s, early 2000s. And then WCW folded. He came to the WWE. He kicked everyone's candy asses. And, uh, and then basically went into seclusion and never saw him again for 15 years. And then he came out in, what, 2018? He beat Kevin Owens for the title. Um had like three or four matches versus um, versus Brock Lesnar where he won three of them and then lost at WrestleMania. Um, I'm going to say Drew McIntyre is going to win this, but what, what I said the last match for the Universal Championship, I'm like, if they want... I always thought that they wanted Spear versus Spear and that was Roman Reigns versus Goldberg. It would make sense for them to have Goldberg win the title and then have... Roman Reigns lose to Kevin Owens, and then Roman Reigns come over to Raw and challenge Goldberg for the WWE title. Um, obviously, I don't think that's going to happen, considering I've already said Roman Reigns is going to win. Um, but yeah, 
I, my pick is for Drew McIntyre to retain the championship. I don't think Goldberg's going to win, but we've seen crazier things happen. <coughs> All right, the next match I have is the Women's Tag Team Championship, in which we got Ashka and Charlotte Flair, the champions, versus Nia Jax and Sha Shayna Bla ba Bas Baszler. Um... I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick Nia Jax and Ben Baszler to win this one. Um, Ashka and Shaw Flair have kind of had the, um, have had the big victories lately, um, on the TV shows and stuff like that. So I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler to re to not retain because Shaw Flair is the champion right now with Ashka, but I think Nia Jax and Sh and Baszler will become the new WWE Women's Tag Team Champions. Uh, the next one is for the Intercontinental Championship. Um, I have Big E, the champion, versus Sami Zayn. Easy. Big E has not... Re so he won the championship one on Christmas Day against Sami Zayn. Um, he's not had a title defense, really, I don't think, since. Um, but I'm going to have Big E with his first title defense beating um, Sami Zayn. And uh, retaining the Intercontinental Championship. They've got big things in store for Big E, I think. And this is just the start, boys and girls. Uh, the next match is for the United States Championship. We've got the almighty Bobby Lashley, the champion, versus Riddle. I don't know. I'm not a big Riddle fan. I, th I think Riddle has people that like him. Um... Uh, but I think what I think they're building something with the um, oh my gosh what do what do they call Bobby Lashley and uh, MVP the hurt the hurt the hurt locker the hurt ah whatever they they're called um, they're going to be splitting up soon I believe and I think it's going to start with uh, some titles being lost because right now they hold the tag team championship with Shelton Benjamin. Um, and they hold the United States Championship with Bobby Lashley. So um, I believe this is going to be the first title that they're going to lose. And it's going to start there. And remember, this is the season for WrestleMania. It's going to be a big matchup somehow among this um, among these three guys. Two of them will probably battle it out. The other will try, probably try and get their championship back. And that's Bobby Lashley. Because Bobby Lashley, I believe, is going to lose to Riddle. Um, I'm not a big Riddle fan, but I have this feeling that Riddle will win this match. All right, now for the two big matchups. So the winner of these matches gets a shot at the WWE Championship at WrestleMania. We've got the WWE Men's Royal Rumble. Uh, we just got Edge. We just heard that Edge is going to be coming in. Um, Dolph Ziggler, uh, probably Sami Zayn, Mustafa Ali, Jeff Hardy, um, Sidero. Um, why can't I think of this, say his name? Sidero. Sidero. Otis. Shinsuke Nakamura, Sheamus, AJ Styles, Jey Uso, John Morrison, The Miz, Bobby Lashley, Daniel Bryan, Big E, and Randy Orton. Um, yeah, I'm like, and then there's going to be like 15 other people coming in. Um, there's always going to be surprises. There's always going to be NXT wrestlers in. Um, I'm sure that uh, that big guy from, that big guy from the, uh, oh, what's his name? Oh, I can't think of his name right now. But he actually had some matches against Drew McIntyre, which would make more sense. Um, Lee, Keith Lee, Keith Lee, um, Drew McIntyre. Um, so there's gonna be some interesting ones, but I think the champ, I think the one, the, the guy that's gonna win this is gonna be AJ Styles. AJ Styles hasn't had a title run in a while, and uh, this is gonna be this. Uh, his his moment. He's going to be having this uh, WrestleMania moment. He's going to uh, win the Royal Rumble. Then he's going to go to WrestleMania and either beat Drew McIntyre or um, Roman Reigns for the championship. Or it could be Goldberg. Or it could be Kevin Owens. Who knows? Um, so yeah, so my pick is going to be AJ Styles to win this match. To win the WWE Men's Royal, uh, Royal Rumble. Now let's get over to the ladies. We're going to predict the women's Royal Rumble match. This is the fourth time that this has been um, this is the fourth time that th they've had the women's Royal Rumble. Um, I'm trying to think of who won. Charlotte Flair has won. 
and pff, why can't I, I'm, I'm drawing blank I'm drawing blank all right so the ladies that are could that are gonna be in this are gonna be Nia Jax Charlotte Flair Bailey Bianca Belair uh, Mandy Rose Dana Dana Brooke Peyton Royce Sean Briesler Alexa Bliss Liv Morgan Ruby Riot uh, Tamina there's gonna be of course some of the class some some of the classic wrestlers some of the all stars. Some of the vets are going to be in this as well. Um, my th 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 this one's going to be a tough one to pick. Um, I was going to pick Nia Jax, but I think they're going to win the tag team championship. So I don't think it's going to be Jax or um, Baszler. Could be Charlotte Flair. Charlotte Flair is Mrs. Royal Rumble for sure. Um, yeah, Alexa Bliss. Alexa Bliss should be that should be an interesting. Actually, I think that's in the match that I missed. Alexa, I think Alexa Bliss is um, going up against uh, Ashka. Um, so if Alexa Bliss and Ashka go up against each other, I think Alexa Bliss is going to win the women's championship. Um, yeah, I don't know why I can't find these matches, but yeah, Alexa Bliss will win that. So if Alexa Bliss wins the championship, she won't win the Royal Rumble. Um, so I think it's going to be Charlotte Flair. I think it's going to be Charlotte Flair that's going to win the Royal Rumble. She's going to be in there till the end. And, uh, yeah, I think she's the one. She, she's coming off injury. She won the Tag Team Championship. She has a hell of a WWE Champion. Now, she's won this before. So I'm like, will, will they actually give her another victory on this? But then I see the names, and I'm like, yeah, they probably will. They probably will. Charlotte Flair is going to win the Women's Royal Rumble, her second time winning this, and uh, yeah, all right, guys. So that's all the matches that I have. So hopefully, hopefully I got the majority of them. We'll see. Um, if there's more, I might uh, type in who I'm who I'm gonna pick um, as I find out. Also, remember that the Miz has the money in the bank. So if Drew McIntyre or Goldberg, that's another thing. The Miz could become champion because Drew McIntyre could dominate Goldberg or Goldberg could dominate Drew McIntyre. But then someone gets hurt. John Morrison and The Miz can come down with that money in the bank and they can win this. They can win the championship as well. Uh, because the money in the bank guarantees you a matchup for the WWE Championship at any point in time. Whether the match is just starting or it could be near the end. So... Watch out for The Miz, because maybe The Miz will become the WWE Champion. Alright guys, so remember to subscribe to the Cali Enjoy Squad. Hit that notification button so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Smash that thumbs up button, share with friends and friends. And next time, what I will do is we'll open up some WWE cards when we, op when we predict the next pay-per-view. And we'll definitely do that for WrestleMania. Um, so there should be one in February, and then one in April... Actually, there might be, even be one in March. There might be two of them coming up. Um, there's definitely WrestleMania at the start of April. So, yeah, let's get to it. Let's enjoy Royal Rumble this Sunday. And uh, until next time, peace out.